Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Pumpkin Jack. Last time, we left off here in the swamp, doing this stuff, and we're a samurai, and I just started a fire in the forest, probably not a good idea. All this for some witch. Her information better be worth all this fuss. And yeah, we probably got a boss fight ahead, so... Hmm... What is it now, bird? It's this forest, I can't describe it, but it's strange. I can sense a witch's magic, she's not too far from here. But watch your step, Jack. Something tells me this forest is dangerous if you don't know the way. If you're not careful, one wrong step could be the end for you. So can you- so you can tell me all that, but you can't tell me how to get through safely? It's called a plot contrivance. Don't dwell on it, just get going. I wish I could help you, but this time you're on your own. Oh, Damn plot contrivances. What happens when the crow eats your trail of breadcrumbs? The crow becomes the breadcrumbs. Uh... Okay, so... I... This is probably like... Um, what were they called? The Twilight? No, not the Twilight Woods. The Forsaken Forest in, uh, Paper Mario. You gotta, like... Look for the... Way that looks different, I guess? Okay, never mind. Never mind. Maybe that wasn't the right way. I thought that was the right way, but no, that was not the right way. Is this just gonna be, like, trial and error? Or do I just ignore the crows every time? Just don't go the way the crows are. Is, is that what this is? Seems to be the case. Just screw the crows. Crows are lies. Anyone got a map? Who needs a map? Uh, okay, crows. Crows. So wait, which way do I go this time? There's crows over there. Well, maybe... There's another option past here. Yeah, okay, so there's crows that way. Ah, but there's crows that way. Well, I certainly can't go that way. There's crows right there. Okay, so let's go this way then. Yeah, okay. We're doing it. All right, there's some crows. There's more crows. So the crows just mark the way you're not supposed to go. Should I ask for directions? No. I can do it. Look at me. I'm doing it. Plus, if we ask for directions, we have to stop and talk to somebody, and, uh... Yeah. I don't know about Jack, but, uh, I'm pretty introverted, so... Uh, nope. And, okay. Yes, hello? Hmm, this is harder than I thought. You're not even doing anything. You're just talking. Okay, well, there's... Okay, we're good. We're good. I will defeat you, Lost Woods. Well, I mean, I get this is less Lost Woods and more Forsaken Forest, I feel. Uh, well, we can't go that way, so we must have to jump this. Yeah. Hey, bud. How you doing? Not much further, Jack. She can hardly wait to meet you. Uh, okay. Okay, well, there's crows over that way, so no. This way seems good. That guy gives me the willies. Is that so? Quit that. I like this weapon a lot more than, uh, both the shovel and the, uh, like, scythe thing. It's just, I don't know, it's better. It's moveset's better, too. I like it a lot. Plus, we get to do this cool floating stuff. You still have much to learn, grasshopper. But we also gotta deal with this stupid asshole. Acting like he's superior to us every single time. Alright, so I guess we want to go this way. There's no crows this way. Yes, hello. Alright, there's crows. Okay. So we got more of these, huh? Uh, yeah, that way has crows, so that's not the way to go. This way does not have crows. So this is the way to go. Man, what happens if I die all the way over here? Do I have to redo all of this again? That would suck. I'm glad I found the gimmick out pretty quick. I mean, it's pretty obvious, to be fair. I guess that's her. Hello. Oh, ho, ho, Jack Jack, the Great is back. I'm such a big fan. Ooh, look at me, I'm starstruck. Finally, someone who appreciates my hard-forged legacy. 
I've been told you might have some information about someone I need to find. You mean the wizards of hu the wizard, the human's champion? Of course, word travels fast, you know. So I've been told. So what can you tell me? Hmm, perhaps you'd like to know his name. His name? Yes, tell me. Oh yes, Jack, anything for a legend like you. Now listen closely, the wizard's name is... Yoink. 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 What kind of name is Yoink? No, 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 you're not saying it right. It's more like... Yoink. I was about to say, she's probably screwing us over, right? Oh no, our head! Yoink! Ah, what the hell are you doing? I'm so sorry to trick you, Jack, but after all, it is one of yours. My own ploy is used against me. Well played, you harpy. D don't forget my part in all this, Jack. Shush, hun, you're sounding really desperate. Put me back right now. I'm afraid I can't do that, Jack. I'm cooking up something magical, and you're just what I need to put it all together. We should go, dear, before we miss our time. Right, away, away. This is horrible. What the heck are we gonna do now? We're going to l get Jack back before they hollow out his noggin. Even more. B but how? You know how Jack can hop in and out of his body? Y yes Well, hop in. Or, I think I need to throw up first. We better head off now. <laughs> ta ta. The pumpkin is perfect, and it's the last ingredient I need. I'm on my way, Jack. Wait, I thought they were gonna hop in my body. Okay, well, that was rough. So the great Jack has fallen six times, yep. I thought the crow was gonna hop in my body. Or did the owl hop in my body? Ow. Ow. I find it's kind of hard to dodge some of these things. Huh? Because there's not a lot of space to dodge. I suppose I can jump them, though. It's probably better. Get him, horsey. You will not defeat me. I will get my head back. Can't believe you deceived me like that. My greatest fans. Makes me sad. Hop. And hop. Ow. Quit that. The music in these sections is always super loud. I've had to turn it down in uh, editing. Because yeah, it gets quite loud. How does she even aim when that stuff's going on? Okay, jump. Oh, I almost caught him there. Almost. How long does this go on? I'm not looking the healthy right now. Is this it? Okay, good. Ha ha ha! Finally, we have some guests come to visit. And all it took was a small act of kidnapping. Get back that pumpkin now. Whatever wicked spell you're working on, we'll stop it. Well, well, the spell, you know. The mushrooms, the cauldron, the possessed pumpkin. Oh, you stupid bird. This isn't a spell. It's our dinner. Your dinner? Of course, we're vegans. <laughs> this is a magic mushroom stew. Why eat me? This is hardly cruelty-free. Well, no, but pumpkins are real superfood, especially possessed ones. You know how hard it is to get souls in a vegan diet? You don't count. Ugh, you're both insane. I may be a coward, but I'm taking Jack back. You don't want to stay for dinner? Ha ha ha, well then, we'll make a fine centerpiece for our spread. Well, that's definitely not vegan. <clears throat> don't scruff up my body, bird. I just got that thing. Eep. All right. So, imagine we pop the eyes? No. Make like shampoo and go for the eyes. <laughs> make like shampoo. Oh, do we knock these things into them? Yeah, okay, that's what we do. Got it. Alright, I was just attacking them with my sword. Oops. Okay. Have a drink on the- okay, we don't want to hit the fire ones. I've learned that, because those hurt us. 
Alright. Mac. So I imagine when we get all the eyes on, like, one level, it falls, so we can actually reach the top ones. Because right now, I can't do that. There we go. Yeah. Hey, killing a tree is a eco-crime. Uh, LB? Ow. Okay, let's go ahead and grab some HP here. So what are we supposed to do during this phase? Oh, do I actually have to kill these things? Okay. I thought we were just dodging. There we go. Smack. Alright, there we go. Give us a smile, Jack. Uh, excuse me? Don't do that, please. Okay, so now you're attacking us too. Okay, this boss fight's a bit more difficult than that other one was. There's a, a lot of stuff going on here. Okay, smack. Whoop, smack that wrong. There we go. Uh, damn it, I missed. Uh, I need to smack that one back there. Uh, nope, I wanted to hit this one. Ow. Okay, we need to heal again. We need to heal again. So let's go over here and grab some barrels. Uh, ow, he got me. Uh. Alright. Now let's see if we can focus on this eye again. There we go. Okay. We're good now. It seems like the barrels are respawning, or I'm just not getting them all. Smack. There we go. Hey, killing a tree is a blah blah blah. Alright. Alright. Good there. The crow seems pretty good at fighting, actually. Surprisingly. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Okay, you're kind of just throwing them all in the same spot, which makes it a bit harder to... Okay, I got one of the eyes. There we go. Got another one. Ow. Got hit by something. Uh, ow. Okay, I got one of the eyes there too. I really gotta watch my health here. I'm taking quite a beating. There we go. Nope. Uh, try not to get hit by this dude's stupid whip or whatever he has. Yeah, I should just wait for it to come around again. No more barrels or anything for us to break. No, there's some over there. Okay. There we go. Oh, okay. That's our chance. Take him down. Yeah, eat it. Please don't hurt me. Well, too bad. As you ragged all out of control. Hold on, Jack. I'll get you back in this weird body of yours. This is so freaky. Hey, look over there. Guess that witch picked up a spare magic wand. Uh, that is not a magic wand. That is a blunderbuss? Uh, excuse me? We just have a blunderbuss now? What a misstep. In their hubris to hunt down the wizard, Jack and his avian accomplices followed the only trail available that they could find in the woods. At the behest of a fawning merchant, Jack was sent on a wild goose chase in the hopes of meeting a powerful witch. Traversing the merciless landscape on horseback, and with the help of an ignoble ferryman, Jack's efforts soon paid off, and he met with the witch, only to have his own head stolen for their supper. With the assistance of the cowardly crow, Jack was reunited with his body. And now, with the wizard's trail run cold, Jack and his companions have only instinct and gumption to guide them. They hurry to follow the sounds of cannons and gunfire to find a city at war. Hmm. Well, this sounds neat. And now I got you. Okay, this seems fun. Now that I just have a blunderbuss. 
I think I still may like the sword more, but this seems very powerful. Well, if it isn't Jack, how nice to see you again. I'd say the feelings are mutual, but you're a rotten little jerk. Lovely, I so enjoy our talks, but I'll make do without them. This is the end for you, Jack. You're in human territory now, and I might not be able to stop you with the monsters, but I can give you hell for my own kind. They're still useful like that. You're a sick, sadistic maniac. If we'd met when I was alive, you might have been my best friend. And you, my best test subject, but here in the real world, I'm far past the need. You rely on that troublesome crow, so I've taken the liberty of creating a shield spell for my men. Your little friend will be powerless to hurt them now. If you want to kill my men, you'll have to get, a, get in there nice and close yourself. So why are you telling me this? For the sake of observation, watching you kill my men will give me very useful data. By the time we cross arms, I will know your every move. Until then, Jack. Wow, so he just took the ability to use my crow away? Or at least it won't hurt them when I do it? Weird. Okay. Okay, the spinning spears are a weird touch. Very weird touch. Okay, I hear a crow skull. Yep, there it is. Eek! Trebuchets! Watch out, Jack! This guy, these guys mean business. I don't see any trebuchets. Are there some? Oh, there's one. Okay. Alright. Yeah, so there are some trebuchets. Uh, I just want to make sure there's no crow skulls that I'm missing around here. Or potentially a gramophone. I mean, they could put one this early. Yeah, there's a crow skull. Oh, and there's another one. Okay. Yeah, there's just some hidden all around here. Uh, okay. I don't know if falling in that water would have killed me, but I'm not willing to take the chance, if I'm going to be honest. Yeah, you guys suck at aiming. Or rather, I'm just constantly running, so it's kind of hard to hit me. Yeah, I mean, they don't really lead their shot. If they led their shots, I would be in a bit more trouble, I feel. But they don't lead. At all. Okay, um... Yeah, I think we're good on... Uh, whoop. I think we're good on, uh, the crow skulls. At least I think so. Look over there, it's another plank! There we go. Wow, that is strong. Yeah, this thing is good. I mean, I should have expected that, but... There's another plank. Where? Talking about over there? Where, where are you talking about? You said, look, over there, there's another plank. I'm not sure what he's going on about. Hmm. Okay. Well, I guess we get up there some other way, so... I honestly just came back here because I thought it would have a crow skull waiting for me, but it did not. So, on we go. Hmm. Yeah, you guys are shooting me again. I get it, I get it. Yeah, so we gotta talk to you. Ooh, this is a fine how-do-you-do. Do. We're in the middle of a war zone. What are we even doing here, bird? Don't tell me we're lost. Perish the thought. We're not lost. We're just picking up the trail. That little misadventure with the witch threw me off the wizard's scent. But now I'm positive that the ma wizard's magical signature can be traced through here. So he was here recently? Very recently. He must have just passed through. Then we're storming this place. Quite right, Jack. The moat is intraversible, but the old siege tower could help us cross over the wall. Ooh, let's get crafty. Grab some of the scrapped planks from around here. We could use them to rebuild the tower. Four solid planks should do the trick. Now get to work. Oh, that's why they mentioned a plank. I thought they meant one of the planks that we, like, knock down. And it allows us to get to someplace. Well, that's what they were talking about, but no. There's, like, little plank bridges we make by, uh... Getting the crow to knock him down. There's our first plank. Alright, well. There was like a green beam where that one was, so... Okay, yeah, there's another one up there. I think I see a plank on top of this tree, Jack. Are those... Okay, those are skulls. I thought they were brains. Well, I was like, why are you guys hanging skulls from your trees? But I, I doubt the human did that. The humans did that. 
Okay. Two down, two to go. Ah, there's one over there. I don't see another one. Oh, there's one over there. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I guess that's what the crow was talking about when he mentioned, I see a plank over there. And I had no idea what he was talking about because I ignored the crow. I mean, the uh, owl, because I wanted to explore. Because I was scared the owl might start some sort of event or something. Jump. All right. And jump. Okay, barely, but we did it. That makes three planks. Sure does, you can count. Congratulations. Run, 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 as fast as you can. You can't catch me, I'm the pumpkin man? The pumpkin man. I'm going with that. Hop. And hop. And hop. And there we go. Hello. That should be enough, Jack. Let's head back to the owl. Alright. How's the owl not been killed by, like... Well, I guess they're not gonna shoot an owl. Unless they're, like, weird sadists. And they're just like, I'm gonna mess up that owl. It's just sitting there. And it annoys me. Some, like, future serial killer stuff. Alright. Hello. And to think this wood was just going to waste. Tut tut. Waste not, want not. Let's go, let's upcycle this tower. And they're just gonna let us build it? Yeah, they just let us build it, I guess, without hitting us with a trebuchet. That's our way in, Jack. Let's storm the keep. I can't believe they just let us rebuild it like that. Craziness. How friendly of them, though. New checkpoint. Alright, so these are some new enemies. They're actual humans. The perimeter has been breached. On guard, foul gourd. Uh, hi. I notice you have a shield. Well, I have a gun. Yeah, my gun is kind of very effective against you guys. Like, this gun is just busted. Like, I can just keep, ra keep a distance and just mess these guys up. It's kind of insane. There we go. So much better than Crow. I mean, I guess that's why they gave us this when they did. Dead. I feel kind of bad about just killing people, to be honest. Do I not just have to blow this stuff up? Okay, I don't, evidently. So where am I supposed to go then? I thought I would, like, blow this up. And that would allow me to, like, get over here. But evidently that's not the case. It really seemed like it was something I would blow up. Hmm. Yeah, let's go with this, maybe? No. Huh. Oh, do we knock this into it? And that, like, blows it up? No. Huh. Huh. I can't use the crow for anything. Like, it really seems set up so that, uh... I have to knock that into that. Is there anything I can do back here? Doesn't seem like it. Huh. Odd. Yeah, it really seems like I'm supposed to, like... Oh, I just push it. Okay, never mind. I thought just hitting it with the crow would kind of move it in there. Uh oh, it's gonna blow. Run, Jack. All right, I was just confused. Uh, hi. No, you don't. You got a sniper rifle, dude? Why are your other dudes running around with like guns and shit if you have like a sniper? Although I guess it could just be a regular rifle. It's not like it has a scope on it. Ugh, snipers, seriously? Get good, you filthy campers. Oh yeah, these guys have ops. Ow. All right. We're good. You got called a filthy camper by my crow. How you like that? Oh, uh, there's a crow skull up there. Can't be missing those. I want all the costumes I can get. Uh, okay, got it. And now let's fall. All right, and hop. Boom. No, you don't. 
I am too good for you. Huh, huh. There we go. Saw another crow skull hiding over here. Also a gramophone. Hello. Alright, what dance we got? Work it, Jack. Work it. Huh, show them what you got. Put those hips to work. Hmm. Yeah, you're beautiful. You're doing it. Look at you. Still don't know what that does for me. Maybe it's how you get some kind of secret ending or something? I, I don't know. Because it's not like we get a buff or anything for it, I don't think. Is my health bar getting longer each time I do that? I, I haven't really been paying attention to my health bar that much, so... Wait, I thought they were shielded. They're not shielded from the crow. Oh, I guess only some of them are? I thought any of them with, like, the blue light around them were considered shielded, or all of them were considered shielded, but... Apparently it's just the ones with the actual bubble. Not the regular basic dudes. Which sucks for them, I guess. Health, please. Even though I don't need it. Alright, well, there's another checkpoint. This level's neat. I like this. I see a big bad guy on a big bad machine. Oh yeah, there's that guy. Yeah, that guy is a ballista. We don't want to deal with that ballista. I'm camping against you now, nerd. Alright, let's push. I imagine we gotta just push this thing down there. Yeah, I imagine that's what's gonna happen here. Alright, let's keep a... ear out for some crows. No, you don't. You know, if you didn't do the Garen spin attack, you would probably be a bit more effective against me. I don't know why you chose that in particular. Also, how is that Ballista rapid fire? That is not how Ballista work. Uh... You kinda got off the thing. Yeah, that's not how Ballista work, alright? I hate to break it to you. Alright, get out of the range of that. Haha! -ha. Now I sneak back around and push. Not getting me, nerd. I've got a nice little house to hide, but- Oh, hello. There we go. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Oh god, that guy got annihilated. Poor guy. Well, they are trying to kill me, so I guess not, poor guy, but they're also the good guys in this scenario, so yes, poor guy. That guy's just doing his job, you know? I hear another one. The other, oh, it's up there. Okay. Well, I can probably get up there later. Can't shoot me when I'm this close, can you? Okay, man, maybe you can. I'm just trying to make sure I'm not missing any crow skulls, dude. They're kind of a hobby of mine. You know? Because I hate crows, I guess. Alright, push. Oop. Screwed that up. Uh, uh, push. Okay, dodge. Not hitting me, sir. And back in we go. And you go boom now. Goodbye. Kaboom! Heh, <laughs> I guess size really doesn't matter if you're a lousy shot. Okay, so now we got one of these. Uh, are those mines? Weird. Jump and then attack to do a dash. Jump and attack to do a dash. Okay, I kind of thought I was going to need to interact with this thing, but I guess not. Uh, what am I doing here? Oh, is this like whack-a-mole? Oh, it is. It's whack-a-mole. I thought I was actually trying to get somewhere. Yeah, yeah, that's totally what this is. Well, I don't need to jump and dash. I can just run at them. I'm fast enough. There we go. Okay, that was way simpler than I thought. I thought those were like mines that were gonna blow me up if I got too close to them or something, but no. I was completely wrong. Alright. There we go. So we can go over there, but there is a crow skull over here. Well, those are giant people. If that's, if that's actually a person I see sitting over there. Okay, this is no longer here, so I gotta do a leap of faith for it now. 
I was supposed to get that earlier, I guess, somehow. Or I was just supposed to make a leap of faith for it. Either way, we did it. Huh. Okay. I was a bit worried about that for a second. Alright, just allow me to squeeze through here, Spears. Thank you. Hi? Jeez, can you believe this? We're stuck on gate duty, but Jerry gets to man the trebuchet. You got that right. Jerry always gets the best jobs. Hey, at least nothing's ever gonna come this way. This is the easiest job ever. Ahem. Yikes, a monster. A real monster. We're under attack. Oh, the irony. Where's Jerry when you need him? Jerry! Forget the irony. Get to the carts. We gotta close the gate pronto. Three, two, one. Uh, oh. Oh, it's that kind of cart. Okay, well, they're dead. Uh, never mind. They're back now? Hey, that's cheating. Where the heck is the referee? Wait, what, wait, what happened? What, are they coming back to life or something? Is that what he's freaking out about? I mean, I can just keep running you guys over. Nope. No, you don't. Don't you rubber band me. Dead. Uh-uh. You quit that. You too. Dead. Dead. No. Ah, oh, shit. Well, you can't make an omelet without breaking seven eggs. I see. I wonder if there's a different one of those for, like... I wonder how high it goes. There's a different little message. I always hate these kinds of sections in games, but hopefully this one isn't too terribly difficult. Like, I think of racing... Like, mandatory racing sections and a lot of platformers. I'm just really bad at them. Hey, that's cheating. Where the heck is the referee? Is he talking... Is he referring to the rubber banding, actually? Because that guy's totally rubber banding. Which is another reason I hate, uh... Platformer, like, race missions. Because rubber banding is a thing. But this one doesn't seem too bad. Yet, at least. No. You quit that. Hey. Slow down. Quit. No. 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 Shit! Oh no, they... They got there first, Jack. We've been locked out for good. Damn it. I thought I was going as fast as I could. Jeez. I guess I should have made sure I killed them or whatever. How do they keep coming back after I murder them? There were only three. I don't understand if there were like 20 guards watching the door, but there wasn't. So it doesn't really seem like it matters how far ahead or whatever they get from me at this part. It's mostly just all about killing them at the end. Like, once we see the finish, finish line, I just need to murder them all. Because they kind of just die like crazy here, so... I guess I should just focus on living for this part. And then once we get to the uh, finish line, I can just murder them all. There it is. Hey! No, you don't. Uh-uh. 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 There we go. We did it. You made it, Jack. If only I had money on this race. Alright. Well, we can keep going. I was thinking uh, I might want to do these episodes a little long because uh, I think there's a game I'm going to want to play coming out soon. So, yeah. Um, so what? Do I just jump down? I guess so. I mean, there's a crow skull down here. Ah, oh, cool. And there's the merchant. Can I unlock anything cool? Hi, friends. Phew, Jack, hello. Funny how we keep running into each other. What are you doing here? This place is a war zone. A war between the monsters and humans? How could I refuse? There's new customers to the left and fresh corpses to the right. And here I am in the middle of it all, making an absolute killing. How shrewd. Care to browse my new stock? Talk about a fresh look. Alright, so we had the samurai. Will you go for the inspector or the skeleton? Let's go for the inspector. Sure. I, like I said, I want to try and get them all. How many are there? Okay, there's the skeleton and the buzzard are the last ones. Okay. I should have enough by then. Unless the buzzard requires... Like, getting them all actually requires you getting every single crow skull. Or if there's extras. So we might only be able to get the skeleton, but... I can see the city from here, Jack. Not much further till we're there. Okay, so you're one of the ones that's actually protected from the crow. 
Uh, okay, not within range. Aha! Die. There we go. Goodbye, friends. Okay, so, yeah, we wanted to push this cart down here, I guess. Yup. Look at us, we're an inspector. Inspector Gadget. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Uh. Uh, okay. Nope. I realized I was saying the Inspector Gadget, like singing the Inspector Gadget song wrong. I think. I think. I don't know. I haven't, I haven't seen or heard anything about Inspector Gadget basically since I was a kid, so... You stop that. I said you stop that! Wait, did he get shot by the ballista? <laughs> friendly fire, friendly fire! Aha, we're already here now, nerd! Kablammo! If only they didn't leave all these potions just sitting around. Yes, burn, baby burn. I might be enjoying this a little too much. That's okay. Oh, cool, it's the boatman again. Okay, it just saved again, but... Where are we going? Oh, look, it's you again, the cheapskate who doesn't know how to tip the ferryman. No one has prepaid for your travel this time, Jack. I trust you brought your coin purse this time. Certainly, I can pay you a five-finger fee to the face, or you can just take me through. Huh, stingy Jack indeed. Very well, I'll take you across this time, but I'm starting a tab, Jack. Alright. Take a ride. All aboard. Okay, I can't help but notice there's a crow skull over there. I'm just gonna jump to that really quickly. Okay, and then let's get back on the boat. There we go. Uh, yeah, we can't deal with these guys really. We just kind of just have to dodge their gunfire. This guy I could deal with. Yeah, there we go. Just a shotgun to the face. That'll that'll do him. There we go. Grab some health. We mostly just have to make sure we don't fall into the water. Time to jump ship. I'm sure to get a lot of ships. Uh, okay, I'm gonna need a different weapon for this. This will be much more effective for dealing with these guys than the shotgun. Just because there's so many of them. Okay, switch back to the blunderbuss. Alright, let's just chill. Okay, get back on there. Got it. Hey, quit that. Alright, uh... Die, die, die. Let's just break a bunch of boxes, get some HP back. Alright, I imagine we just gotta hop across these platforms while he goes over that way. Time to jump ship. I wasn't even on the ship. And go. There we go. Time to jump ship again already? We just jumped ship. Okay, maybe I should try the blunderbuss for this. Let's see. Okay, no, we, we get overwhelmed pretty quickly if I try to stick with the blunderbuss there. It's good for strong single enemies, but when you're getting crowded like this, it's not effective, surprisingly. There we go. All right, was that it? That might be it. It was. All right, we can actually drink this time. It's our last free ride, you cheapskate. Next time you pay in full. All right, we'll go for one more save point, I think. Like I said, I uh, am interested in starting something that comes out soon, so. I uh, wanna get through this in time, if I can. And I can see how many levels there are left, so... That gives me a pretty good idea of how... long I need to play. Here we go. Alright, two crow skulls just- oh. I gotta finish killing you guys. Dead? Dead. Alright, thank you for the crow skull. And... let's hop up here. Grab you. 14 out of 20. That must mean we're almost done with the level. Hop. Hop. 
Ah, oh, one of these, huh? Anything hiding over here? Doesn't seem like it. Nope. Alright. Let's go ahead and detach ourselves. Oh, this thing again? Yeah, I, I guess the little dash attack is pretty useful. Like, you don't need it, but it's helpful. It's for getting around very quickly, I might add. Like, you can finish it really quickly if you just spam the dash attack. Bum ba dum. Bum 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 bum. Alright, so jump. Jump. And away we go. Okay, we almost went too far away. Uh, I'm, I'm looking for go for 45 minutes, so I think we're gonna go for one more. This bridge is stuffed with explosives. I don't know about this, Jack. We'll be fine. Hmm, do we go left or right? Uh, this way? I mean, it's the more dangerous route, but we're fine. Tower's in our way, Jack. I think you know what to do. I sure do. Die, rat hole. There we go. Give me up here. Grab this crow skull. And then we just gotta push this bad boy over here. And kablooey. 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 Boom. My cat's just pulled up the blind to look out the window. What you see, buddy? Anything interesting? Aha, I knew it. I was right. Let's double back and make our way across. Will do. And hop. Yeah, this double's pretty neat. They got a lot of uh, interesting platforming going on that I really enjoy. This might be one of my favorite ones, which is interesting, because you wouldn't think I would like the one that's just like war zone area, but here we are. I made a mistake. I made a mistake. Okay, but we're good. <laughs> that was a mistake. Jump. And jump. Alright, we did it. We did it. There we go. Shoot. Shoot. Alright, is there anything over there? I mean, it looks like I can get over there, but... I don't know. Let's not chance it. Let's just go this way. Oh, I got two snipers trained on me. Hey, friends. I've come to murder you. Goodbye. Huh, huh. There we go. Alright, we got one more to deal with. It's just you, buddy. Dead. Alright. So, now we're way up here. And this allows us to get across here, and there's our checkpoint. Perfectly- look at that. Perfectly at 45 minutes. Uh, I don't hear a crow thing, but it looks like it's kind of tinted the color of it, but yeah. Alright! So, whoop. I hear one now. Aha! I see you. 16 out of 20. Alright, there we go. So that's a good 45 minutes. I think we're going to go ahead and end things off here for this episode of Pumpkin Jack. I hope you have enjoyed, and I will see you next time.